We good? Yes. Okay. Whenever uh, you're ready. Talk to the camera. Yes. All right. Um. <clears throat> uh, hi, hi, everyone. My name is Bob, and uh, and I'm a Torbjorn main. Um. Why don't you explain why you why play I, the game? Okay. Uh, I play I play Torbjorn because. He is awesome all around, whether it's attacking or defending. Uh, there's always something you can do with Torbjorn. Uh, he's short, he's really cool, and, and I like him because I actually feel like I'm helping my team, you know? Um, I actually feel like I'm contributing because, uh, unfortunately, I don't, I don't have arms. So it's, it's impossible for me to play any, any, anybody else, really. It, it sucks, you know, on a day-to-day -day basis. I, I struggle doing a lot of simple things. I struggle with, with brushing my teeth or, or, or cleaning the house. And, and Blizzard thought of that. They knew. And they made this hero specifically for people like me. People with, without arms. So I can contribute and actually play the game. Battlebjorn is a special character. I don't mean special in that he is one of a kind. I mean special in that you have to lick a window to do this well. He's not that great. I mean, he, he really isn't. His gun is pretty damn strong. And it's fun and satisfying to snipe somebody with it. Because it's kind of like a super small Hanzo projectile when you think of it. He's kind of interesting because he can sort of heal himself? Are we going to call his armor that? I mean, you can drop armor for yourself in situations and survive. He has pretty decent base health he's got pretty decent move speed he's a small target like the character itself is a fun one i will not lie i enjoy playing torbjorn and battlebjorn i have never placed a turret though and i don't think i ever will because just the sheer fact that i can get gold medal eliminations or damage or whatever you might want is is fucking hilarious to me and people get really pissed like actually less pissed than when i didn't go turret mode bastion it's weird i'll get to the end of the game and people will be like torbjorn did you even lay a turret down? Here's what I was talking about. I'm dropping armor for myself while getting frozen so I can survive a little bit longer. I mean, that's just the way things go. If he had a bigger magazine, he'd be better. If, you know, if you could get molten core faster, you'd be better. But overall, fuck me if he's not fun to play. Battlebjorn is the better of the uh, two that I was trying out. Battle Mercy and Battle Torb. So... All that aside, how do you kind of play them? I mean, you you realistically aren't going to use your right click unless you're eating their asshole. Like, you got to be way up in there. It's really nice. It's kind of difficult to miss, honestly. And when you Molten Core, you get a ton of health and armor. And you also have a ton of attack speed. Uh, so it... It feels to me like realistically the best way to play this is sit behind kind of like a poor man soldier 76, right? And just sit behind cover, lob some shots out. When you get molten core, just go on in. Now, I've been playing all of this Battle Bjorn before Anna went out. So I don't know how he'd react with Anna's ult when he ults, but it would probably be a little bit disgusting. Um, I, I mean, if you really want to, I think you can play Torbjorn without turrets and be fine and not hurt your team too much. But if you can manage to do this much damage without a turret, I'm curious to see how well I could do if I actually just laid down level 1 turrets. Like, if I didn't spend my time camping and hammering, like, what would happen? And if for those of you guys that were saying, like, yo, do melee, hammer only Torb. Torb's hammer has the hitbox of, like, a fucking... Like a marshmallow. It's tiny as shit. Everything about Torb doesn't seem to have like a reasonable hit marker. His hammer, it's not like Reinhardt where you swing that shit and everybody in a three mile radius feels it. Like no, if you're hitting somebody with this hammer, your reticle has to be right on the, the center mass or it's not doing damage. And it does 70 damage, so it's pretty good. But all, all things aside, Battle Bjorn probably gets my vote uh, for most fun. But I, I have to say that there's some other heroes out there that can be played really shitty and are equally as devastating. I think that this one only works because he's got abilities that help him survive longer, i.e. The, the armor drop and the ultimate. But, like, look at this. Like, this Widow, all right? What the fuck are you doing? Is that a Widow? I couldn't see. I don't know. It's just... You're able to really have a lot of fun with him. And I, I think that you'd be surprised at how much damage and how well you can do because people ignore you when you're not using a turret. People are just like, yeah, it's... It's Torbjorn. Like, why would I care? He's not setting up turrets. So then you're able to sneak around and do a ton of damage. And look at this. I meddle so well with Torbjorn. It's fucking hilarious. Look at this! Four golds! There's a spicy boy up top. I'm scared. Ha! Who's- who's got- oh. Oh, you still do. Nice. I'll take it. Dude, here we go. This is what I'm talking about. Come here. All right. I'll take some armor. 
Here, everybody can have some armor. Look at us. Everybody gets armor. Look at this. Look at this shit. They got sassy and they dropped a, uh, a pharaoh on the map. Look at that headshot there. Like, this hero is stupid. What do you do to defend it? You can't. He's just so goddamn good. That feeling when you waste a, mar a molten core just to fucking save yourself. You don't even get to use it for anything. Bro. Oh! Got him! He got him! Get fucked! <laughs> that was insane! Straight out of Reddit! That was awesome! Gotta do damage, gotta go fast. Easy points, easy victory. Team, take my armor! I have all of this love to give you. The one thing I will say is my left click is all, like, realistically my left click is only- Oh! ARE YOU FUCKING ME?! My left click is only good at medium range. Like anything- long range is too hard to hit. Close range, you might as well just use a shotgun. But what the fuck is the damage? Stop jumping so much, you fucko! That's what I'm saying. Might as well just use a shotgun then. What? What? McCree. Fan of the hammer me. Woo! Juke Master John over here. Um, why were we so bad earlier and now we're just like slaughtering? What the fuck changed and why is this... Why does this Russian think that she can get away? Who has more damage? You or me? It is obviously me, the Battlebjorn! You can't do shit against him. He's a god. They even switched, dude. They can't handle my Bjorn. They can't handle my Bjorn! It's undefeatable. All right, it's time to go ahead and see if we can't find an elusive Torbjorn player that is not at his turret. Let's go around and see- yes, yes, I believe we've got to be careful now. Yes, yes, it seems like we have found one and he is cutting grass with scissors. I, I, I don't know why. I'm assuming that it's because it's such a brain-dead task that only a Torbjorn player could enjoy it. Oh, yes, another one indeed. This one seems to be licking a window. Uh, very common, indeed. If you see a Torbjorn player licking the window, I believe it means he likes you. 